Procrastination is a familiar foe to many of us. We often find ourselves putting off important tasks, whether it's starting a challenging project, tackling a pile of emails, or simply organizing our workspace. The reasons behind procrastination can be complex and varied, but the consequences are the same. Decreased productivity, increased stress, and a sense of dissatisfaction with our own performance. However, there is a simple and effective technique that can help you overcome procrastination and get things done. The five minute rule. The five minute rule is based on the idea that the hardest part of any task is getting started. We tend to build up tasks in our minds, making them seem more daunting and overwhelming than they actually are. By committing to work on a task for just five minutes, you break through the initial resistance and create momentum that propels you forward. It's a small commitment that can lead to significant progress. Here's how the five minute rule works. Choose a task. Identify the task that you've been putting off or find something that requires your attention. It could be a work-related project, a personal goal, or a household chore. Set a timer. Grab your phone, a kitchen timer, or use a timer app on your computer. Set it for five minutes. The key here is to keep it short and manageable. Five minutes is a small chunk of time that feels less intimidating. Start working. Once the timer starts, dive into the task without any distractions. Focus on the specific task at hand and give it your undivided attention for those five minutes. Don't worry about completing the entire task. Just focus on getting started. Ride the momentum. Often, you'll find that once you start working on a task, the initial resistance fades away and you gain momentum. The five minute commitment serves as a catalyst, pushing you beyond the first few minutes and into a productive flow. You'll likely find that you're able to accomplish more than you anticipated in that short span of time. Assess and decide. After the five minutes are up, take a moment to evaluate your progress. Ask yourself if you want to continue working on the task or if you need a break. The goal is to make a conscious decision based on your current state of mind and energy level. If you're in the flow, consider continuing for another five minutes or longer if you need a break, take it, and come back to the task later with a fresh perspective. The beauty of the five-minute rule is its flexibility. It can be applied to various tasks and projects, regardless of their complexity or duration. Whether it's writing a report, cleaning out your closet, or practicing a musical instrument, committing to just five minutes can make all the difference. It helps you overcome the initial resistance and build a habit of taking action. Moreover, the five minute rule is not limited to a single task. You can use it to tackle multiple tasks throughout your day. By dedicating just five minutes to each task, you'll make progress on several fronts, preventing overwhelm and maintaining a sense of accomplishment. Beyond its immediate benefits, the five minute rule can also have a positive impact on your motivation and mindset. It helps you develop a bias towards action, training your brain to associate starting with progress. Over time, this can reduce the tendency to procrastinate and increase your overall productivity. So, the next time you find yourself struggling with procrastination, remember the five minute rule. Commit to working on a task for just five minutes and experience the power of getting started you'll be surprised by how much you can accomplish in those short bursts of focused effort. Embrace the rule, overcome procrastination, and unlock your true potential.